What's up you guys, AvriLR32 here. I wanna make a bit of a different video today. No intro or anything. I want to take the time to put the serious Avery on and explain what is going on here. So for those of you who haven't seen the new Yu-Gi-Oh! Balance Fixes Some Things video, I want to address this comment from Neshi. And he says, hey man, I tried DMing you on Discord. I don't have a message from you on Discord, Neshi, but I noticed you're stealing thumbnails. Any reason why? I want to make something clear here. It has never been my intention to steal anyone's content, to steal anyone's thumbnails. And I'm going to be getting into that in just a minute, but I want to explain this point right here. Just tried to send you a message on Discord, but the Clyde bot says I can't for some reason. I'm going to show that in a second as well. Try to DM you, but I don't steal thumbnails. I always try to give credit to the original creator if I can find out who made it. I just pull my thumbnails off Google Images. Now, if my screen recording will... Let me go over to the next screen here. Okay, it did. Um, these are my thumbnails, as you can see. Um, I've used the new ban list one on the emergency ban list and on the last ban list video. I do not know who created this new ban list thumbnail. Um, if I did, I would put in the description whoever created it. You know, I would say credit to whoever, you know, blah, blah, blah for the thumbnail. Now, this one's different. When I said the state of Yu-Gi-Oh is terrible. I know that DZ makes these kind of thumbnails look like this. So when I saw this thumbnail on Google Images, I didn't have to really figure out who it was. I knew it was DZ, and luckily I found it actually under the video section of Google. So sometimes I'll use Google Images, sometimes I'll use videos, and when it pops up those thumbnails in the video section, you can right-click Save As, and it will save that thumbnail from that video. So I knew from doing that that it was DZ. Now, if you click on this video, if we get rid of the ad here, you will see in the description, credit goes to DZ for the thumbnail. Now, I did not do that for this one. One, because it was a ban list and I was in a rush. And number two, I don't know who created that thumbnail, so I don't know who to give credit to. And the thing is, too, that, you know, you may think, well, Avery, if you go on Google Images, it'll tell you. But if it's, like, not, like, a Reddit user or, like, some sort of username or something, like, that links to YouTube, I don't want to take the risk of crediting that person or linking to that site because that could get my video struck down. In case you don't keep up with Review Tech USA, he does, like, gaming news and things like that. And he will usually link to, like, let's say a Polygon article or an IGN article. Well... YouTube gave him a strike on one of his videos when he attempted to do that. So now he no longer links to those websites unless it's to a direct YouTube video because he doesn't want to risk getting a strike. And that's what I'm trying to avoid as well. So now let's tackle Discord. Now when I pop up my Discord, hopefully you're seeing it here. I'm not sure if the screen recording is getting it or not, but hopefully it is. When I go under Neshi, I tried to send him a message and on my phone, it gave me the Clyde bot error. Now, I don't know shit about uh, <laughs> Discord. Like, I can't Discord my way out of a paper bag. I'll admit that. Um, but I tried to send him a message on my phone, and it gave me the Clyde bot error. And it's not showing up here on desktop. I'm not sure why. Um, I don't know if I have to be part of his Crystal Beast server. But regardless, Neshi, I don't see a message from you. Hopefully, you all are seeing it on screen. And for whatever reason, my message didn't go through because of like a Clyde bot error. Um, but regardless, I want to make clear that I do not, my, it's never been my intention, I should say, to steal people's thumbnails. You know, like I said, I pull these off of Google images, you know, like I'll, I'll go on Google images and I'll type in, you know, uh, shit, let's see if I can even pull it up here. Um, we'll do Google Images Yu-Gi-Oh, you know, and we'll pull this up, images. So now, like, let's say I want, like, like if I was doing a Crystal Beast thumbnail, I could click on this one, right? And now at a glance, like, okay, it's from Pinterest. Uh, who the hell made this on Pinterest? I don't want to link directly to Pinterest, and it was four years ago. So who knows what this user has done in that time. Like, I, I don't want to risk linking to something that is malicious in any way, if that makes sense. Now, it's different if, like, let's say I do, you know, let's say I want a Neshi thumbnail, Yu-Gi-Oh! Neshi. We type in Neshi, right? Well, of course, it's going to bring up that character. But if we do videos, right? 
Okay, cool. Look, here's Neshi looking sexy with his beard. We're looking at this dude with no beard. He should have a beard. <laughs> uh, we're looking at this here. So, like, let's say I wanted to do, hey, I'm doing a Crystal Beast Explain video. I'm going to click on this. I'm already going to know that this is a thumbnail from Neshi. One, because it says right here, Golden Nova Yu-Gi-Oh. So it's either Golden Nova or he let Neshi do a guest upload. Either way, if I take this thumbnail, I'm going to say credit to Golden Nova Yu-Gi-Oh. This one card would be perfect Crystal B support. Hey, look, it's from Neshi. Huzzah! The sexy bearded man gets his shout out if I were to use that thumbnail. Or like this one, the new boss monster's insane. Hey, look, if I use this thumbnail, I'm going to give Neshi a shout out. I'm not saying I took one of Neshi's thumbnails. I know I did a Crystal Beast deck profile recently, so maybe I used one of his and I just didn't realize it. And if I did, Neshi, I'm sorry. Please, you know, let me know. Reach out to me, like, via my email, and I'll get that straightened out. Um... But the point that I'm trying to make, again, is that it's never been my intent to do this. I don't want any sort of drama out there in the community. You know, I, I, I do this for fun. I talk a bunch of shit on the internet. Like, it is what it is. I'm not trying to steal people's content or anything. And if you've watched one of my videos and you're the creator of the thumbnail, whether it's, you know, MCO40, Cyber Knight, Team APS, whoever, um, please reach out to me uh, via an email. You want to reach out to my business email, which you can find if you click on my channel and you go to my about section, you can click view email address. It will say, well, for, for you, it'll say I'm not a bot, but then my email's right here. Like th this is my email. So you can email me about business inquiries. You can email me about, you know, hey, this is my thumbnail. Can you please credit me? And I'm happy to do that. I used to work in news for those of you who don't know that. So we, I'm, I know what it's like to have to credit people. So if I've taken your thumbnail and I just don't know it, I'm sorry. Neshi, if I took one of your thumbnails somehow. I'm sorry. Again, I didn't get your Discord message. Um, and also, just like on a side note, I don't have any beef with Neshi. But Neshi, I also don't really appreciate that you said in a comment, I'm stealing thumbnails. I would have rather you have emailed me directly. And we sorted out that way. Maybe he didn't think about that. Maybe he didn't know that he could pull up my email here. Regardless, I like Neshi. He's a cool dude. Super cool guy. Super down to earth. I'm not going to hold anything against it. You know, maybe it was an oversight on his part, or maybe he heard it from somebody else that's a troll. I don't know. I know that I got a lot of hate on that Dark World video, so maybe people are just, you know, trying to troll me for that. But I wanted to put this out there. I wanted to clear this up before, like, this becomes a big drama thing or something. Um, please know that it's never been my intent to steal any content. Um, so I'm, I'm appreciative just to be on this site with over a 1,000 subscribers. So, guys, I hope that you like this video or learn something, and I just, I wanted to make this clear. So back to our regularly scheduled Yu-Gi-Oh! program, and thank you guys for watching, and I will see you in the next video.